guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I have something different planned. I'm going to be experimenting with dry ice. I have never used dry ice, so this video is going to be interesting. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. So I have this bowl that I'm going to be using to put the dry ice in, and I have this, like, spoon thingy because I don't want to touch the dry ice because it can freeze your hand. So, this is bad, but it's extremely cold. We negative 110 degrees. So. As you can see, it's coming out with the gas. So this gas, so it is currently melting. Okay, there we go, Steph. Now I'm gonna get some pieces out and just put it there. So I might do something I don't know. Go ahead and put it in the bowl. I'm going to be adding in hot water and I've heard that it will make it go a little puff up a lot more so I have this teapot here and now I'm just going to add it in and we're going to see what happens. But it looks so nice and smooth on top. I feel like this is my collagen and I'm a witch. It feels like that. It's so cold on the bottom. It makes a rattling noise. So this is so cool. It fuzz out when I do this. It makes that noise. my hands over it, it's warm even though the dry ice is like 110 degrees below zero. This first one that I'm going to be doing is I'm going to put a bubble over it and maybe it will like puff up and the gas will start coming through. But, so we're going to try that. Oh and before, um, the slime wasn't sticky. Now it's getting sticky. I don't know why that is. But comment down below if you think you know what the answer could to be for that, because I really have no idea what, why it's getting sticky. So I'm just going to start a bubble right here, and I'm just going to hitch it on the end like that. Oh, there are holes in it, and what? It's so cool. It's absolutely so cool. So cool. And when the holes just start, it looks like like a volcano erupting, but so now I'm gonna actually gonna try putting in a little piece of the dry ice. I'm gonna put it into the slime and see what that is. So I'm just gonna push this to the side and I'm gonna get another dry ice. why it's like doing that. So I'm going to put it on the slime now. There we go. I'm just going to put like a little bubble over it and see what it's gonna do. Okay, oh look, it has the gas out of the bubble, that's cool. Let's try doing that again. So I have it on top, it's not really doing anything right now, but it, oh my gosh, it's expanding, that's so cool, it's making a bubble on top, and once that bubble opened up, it's making, it has this stuff coming out of it, gas, as you can see, that's so cool, I'm going to try bursting it, 
Actually, I'm gonna see how high I can get. Whoa, that's cool. So now, this one is called jellyfish. For this one, you're gonna be needing to get a small rope or I'm just using a shoe string. So now what I'm going to be doing is I have a small bowl and I what I'm doing is I have a water and soap mixture in it and now I'm just dunking it in water mixture and now I'm going to just rub it around the edges like so and I'm gonna get this string and just make a bubble over it. It might take you a couple times. once or twice and now I'm going to and I actually did it three times and now I'm going to get the string and go on top of it. I think it's doing it. I'm not sure. Okay, this one it's coming. I'm actually gonna be doing this one really slowly. Wow, there's like wrinkles over here. It looks so cool. get it off like super fast because I was trying this earlier and I took it off super fast. But anyways, it's puffing up. Oh, it's puffing up on the sides too. That's so cool. This one actually has an orangish color. This is cool. I'm going to wash it with my hand. very hot. As you can see in the other ones, I didn't use it because they weren't quite as hot. Now, this isn't quite our bubble monster. Now I'm going to add in some soap. Please subscribe and click the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching.